synonym so synonym already we have discussed so it is nothing but it is an alternate name for any dv object like table view a sequence like this we can create synonym for any database objects the main advantage of synonym is it is going to provide more security alternate name okay so instead of giving direct access on a table to a person so you can create a synonym for a database object so once a synonym is created instead of giving permission on original table just you grant permission on synonym what happens here original table will be protected suppose uh, i will create one synonym uh, create so what is the synonym i will create just i will just look at this example create synonym synonym name is suppose um, this is just like uh, country synonym country s y n for database object database object is suppose i want to create this synonym for which one customer table directly you can write customer just imagine that this synonym this uh, table has been created by ksk user in ksk table ksk user ksk schema we have a table called customer for that customer i have created one synonym called country synonym country synonym for customer this is a way in which you can create a synonym so here the country syn becomes what alternate name for customer suppose here the log, uh, login name the schema name is ksk and uh, suppose from ksk1 ksk1 it is uh, another schema so from ksk1 if you want to access customer table you have to apply a query like this select star from ksk dot customer ksk dot customer select star from ksk dot customer so from ksk schema from ksk schema you are trying to access a synonym sorry a table what is the table name customer okay so if you want to access a object from another schema the object name must be prefixed by the schema name the sch what is the schema name here ksk what is the schema schema is nothing but it is a logical collection of objects is called as a, a schema so while creating a user what happens automatically all the database objects are created okay so for that logical objects owner becomes what the user the particular user becomes owner that means the logical logical objects can be identified by a particular user so in this case the logical objects for the logical objects who is the owner here ksk ksk is one schema ksk1 is the other schema from ksk1 i am trying to access customer table from ksk schema so if you want to access customer table from ksk schema you have to prefix a prefix the table name prefix the schema name how do you, how you can access ksk dot customer now in the previous example, example what i did i have created one synonym what is the synonym here country syn for customer table and uh, directly by using country synonym you can access this customer how to access directly suppose select star from so what is the synonym name here synonym name is country syn here you need not to use any schema name even directly you can or uh, you can access country syn you this is going to give more protection because this is not directly direct object so it is a synonym it is alternate name for customer actual rows actual information is there in customer just by using some alias name we are trying to access the table so by using synonym what happens here directly we are going to achieve some protection security reason for the sake of security reasons we are going to make use of synonyms like this the syntax is create synonym country syn for customer so this is a way in which we can create a synonym the synonym advantage is it is going to provide alternate name for any database object so that what happens here original objects will be secured 
So instead of giving permissions on uh, original object to some other users, so I can create a synonym for a database object directly uh, the synonym can be granted to other users. So that uh, what happens here? Original object will be protected. That will be in a safe manner. Okay, that is the main advantage of synonym. So just I will create one synonym and I will show this in the system just to have a look. Here we have one table called select shop from customers. I will show the user. I will case key. Customer. In cast table no rows are found. Even you can select a, you can create a synonym. I will create create synonym. Synonym name is country S Y N for cast table. Again insufficient privilege. That means case does not have any privilege to create synonym and go to sysdba and grant the permission. So to go to sysdba again connect to sysdba. Just you grant the permission. Grant, create synonym. That means to create a synonym the DBA must have to give permission. Otherwise, a synonym cannot be created by ordinary users. Only DBA can create any kind of object. So, I am granting permission as a DBA now. Grant create synonym to KSK. Grant succeeded. Now, go to KSK user again. Connect KSK by KSK. Now create synonym. Synonym is created. Synonym may name becomes country S Y N. <coughs> and you can drop it. How to drop it? Drop synonym. Synonym name is what? Country. Yes, why? Drop synonym. Synonym dropped. So this is a way you can create a synonym. So the next topic to be discussed is indexes. I am going to create an index. So how to create index and what is index I will explain in detail. <coughs>